first and foremost, I want to give all praises and honor to the Most High and His Holy Precious Son, Yahweh Shah, the true Black Messiah. Also, I want to give much respect to the founding fathers of this truth out of the One West, which set forth the foundation. And I also want to give a shout out to all the Israelites that's, 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 um, that's seeking this truth, that's in this truth, and also to the one third and 144,000 in the hopeful elect of the nation of Israel. The name of this class is I Prefer Her Before Scepters and Throne. Just want to go over the power of wisdom, the power of knowledge, and the power of understanding. This is Wisdom of Solomon, chapter 7 in the Apocrypha, verse 1. It said, said, Wherefore, I pray and understanding was given me. I called upon God, and the spirit of wisdom came to me. I prefer her before scepters and thrones, and esteemed riches, nothing in comparison of her, neither I compare on neither I compare I unto her any precious stones, because all gold in respect of her is as little sand. And the and silver shall be counted as clay before her. I love her above he, above health and beauty and choice to have her instead of light. For the light that cometh from her never goeth out. That's why you read the Ecclesiastes. It says a man wisdom should make his face shine and the boldness thereof should be changed. Showing you that the power of wisdom is very it's very, it's, it's very tangible. It's very precious because when you have wisdom, yo, when you have wisdom, you read the book of Ecclesiastes. It also says that wisdom stricter the wise more than ten mighty men in the city. That means anything you can imagine of is in high authority can compare to the can can compare to wisdom because when you read in the, on the book in the book of Poff, in the in the book in the apocrypha, it also says that um, if riches is to be desired in his life. What is richer than wisdom that worketh all things? So the power of wisdom is very powerful, man. You know, um, you know that's how Yahweh Shah conquered this world was through wisdom. Um, that's how Daniel conquered the line through wisdom. All the greatest men you hear about in the Bible they use wisdom. Um, I'm gonna do a second class to this, but uh, I just want to just go over the power of wisdom with you guys. It was in my spirit to go over this verse. Shalom, Israel.